really incredible just the amount of time and effort and the individual attention that our teachers and our staff are able to give to the families, the students, and it really is something of a tremendous success story that in this area uh, wasn't seen before Horizon showed up here. And it's kind of changed even the game in the entire city of Cleveland of how people operate. It's a lot of the things that are done now over the course of a lot of different schools have sort of stemmed back to the personal lives and uh, education that we're able to give here at Horizon. The first student who uh, went to MIT you know, uh, from a charter school was from us back in 2000. So uh, that was a great achievement because nobody was expecting charter schools or community schools to be that successful. Blue Ribbon Schools, and one local school is the only charter school in Ohio to receive the award. And a Cleveland charter school is on a new list of the best public schools in the U.S. We were awarded the Blue Ribbon uh, from the National uh, Department of Education, uh, which is of course a wonderful honor. Uh, 2014, we were uh, named one of the top high schools uh, in Newsweek magazine. Also, we were uh, able to receive a distinguished Title I school award, you know, for reducing the, the achievement gap between various different groups of uh, student bodies. What I enjoy most about being a Horizon is just the small class sizes and that I get the opportunity to really get to know my students and to design lessons that are targeted to truly suit them and help them learn the best that they can. Every parent, every family, every student needs something a little different. And so it goes back to the individual education, individual getting to know the students. And because we are able to have a smaller group setting, um, a lot of teachers per student, we're able to really get to know the students and what their needs are. Less distractions, you can ask your teacher if you need help or anything like that. It's not her trying to help a million kids and stuff like that. Our parents know that they can reach out to us at any time. We try to make sure that we reach out to our parents as well and let them know any concerns that we might have to be able to nip things in the bud. If our, their students are not doing well academically, we try and give them a heads up on that so we can get together and make a plan to see what's going on with them and where we can help and strive to get their grades up and get them better academically. There's just lots of opportunities for parents to get involved and it's not strange to see a parent in the building helping with something, so I think that's really special about our school that the parents are so closely knitted in with our community. Our college counseling program is, is a big help for the students to prepare for college. And they take the students uh, right from the ninth grade. And they follow, they create a college graduation uh, plan and also a college prep plan. With that, the students are receiving the necessary courses, uh, electives, uh, foreign language, and also they prepare for the ACT or SAT tests. We apply to colleges together, we do FAFSA together, and if they're not sure about college, you know, then we talk about what they'd like to do instead and maybe an associate's degree. A lot of kids have graduated from here too and gotten accepted to a lot of like very good colleges. They help me with the application. My son has been accepted to 10 colleges. My other son who graduated in 2018 was accepted to, I believe it might have been 12. CYSP is Concept Young Scholars Program and it's for all ages, not just high school. And it provides students with a mentor and guidance towards being prepared for college. So they get to do overnight activities, college visits, test prep. We let them tour the colleges, see how it is to be college life. Uh, we take them and do fun things. We've done uh, Kalahari with them. We've done Cedar Point. We've taken them to main events. So it's a mixture of fun activities and then also community service work, cultural exposure. We have opportunity to get service hours and community service and different things and different opportunities, cultural experiences and whatnot that they can do, that they can put on their college application. The groups that partake in CYSP, they're our highest SAT takers. They're the ones that are getting the most college scholarships. They're doing well on those state tests. And it's because they have those extra supports in place. The staff here is really good and well informed. They help you through almost any problems from emotional and personal to
to um, your classes? They help me push myself more. And they really care about our education. Anybody out there that just wanted to come to the school, I think they should come. It's a great school, good programs, good sports teams. It's just a lot, wrestling, basketball, soccer, volleyball, everything is just great.